What's good, y'all? This is Kyla with BC. So you could probably guess who I am. In this video, we're going to get another Family Guy uh, live session in, basically. This is going to be uh, Best of Tom Tucker. Now, the video is kind of long, so I'm probably going to cut it in half. Stop halfway through, maybe do a part two some other time. But uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel. It is free. You're helping me. You're helping yourself deliver more of this content. But uh, yeah, let's get straight into it. Coming up, handsome mustachy old man recaps news in pleasing baritone. Stay tuned for this and more. Hey, hey, I recognize you from the television. You're Tom Tucker. I bet you can do this. Can my wife Stacy get you Weirdo. anything? Go to hell, Tom. Already there, hon. A local boy <laughs> dies after playing video like games for 51 hours straight. He was playing Halo, now he has a Halo. Just kidding, he was gay. Because of an accident today at the Ecohawk Cable Company, all television transmission will be out for an undetermined amount of time. Of course, no one can see this news program, so it doesn't really matter what we say. <laughs> I'm the Lord Jesus Christ. I think I'll go get drunk and beat up some midgets. How about you, Diane? Well, Tom, yeah. I just plain don't like black people. <laughs> you guys God are still damn. on in Boston? <laughs> okay. Ah. Hold on. They still on in Boston. Some midgets should have got together and beat up Tom Tucker and a whole bunch of black females should have got together and beat up whatever the fuck her name was. I forgot. When I think of it, I'll do a video on her too. She's a weirdo too. I see my colleague Tom Tucker is already on the scene. Who's that baby? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, this is Tom Tucker. <laughs> <laughs> evil got twin on. Todd wow. Tucker out to destroy his brother's reputation. Ha ha ha! Now I'm going back inside <laughs> to have free sex with my prostitute, with whom I still have 45 minutes. Oh my god, they've opened fire! Our looks like they're getting very heated here. Twin, though, this is right? not a safe place to be. <laughs> and how's yes, Next up, stay tuned for our special investigative report on the clitoris. Nature's Rubik's Cube. Well, Diane, that last report was so good, I think you deserve a spanking. Well, really, Tom, I don't think your wife would appreciate that. Shit, I saw that, <laughs> that, that frigid old cow lives in Quahog. She can't hear a word I'm I saying. Say Actually, so we're back on the air in Quahog. Quite a situation we've got. He was about to Quite spank a her ass. Tom, indeed, Diane. Today, the Quahog River was dyed red in honor of Valentine's Day. So, if you're looking to do a river murder, this could be your window. Over 200 reports of ear sex have been confirmed <laughs> so far, prompting a new slogan. Once you go black, you go deaf. Look at you, you fat, gross Moroccans, with your ooga booga food. Coming up, yesterday's brisket. <sighs> but first, breaking news. They want me to be the new artistic director of the Quahog Players. All right, Mom! Are you going to do it? I don't know. It's such a big responsibility. Like first season, I, I need a shoot. moment to think. Okay, I'll do it. This just in, Lois Griffin has been named the new artistic director of the Quahog Players. Is this the Quahog Mustache Society? Yes, it is. What's the secret password? Mustache. All right, come on in. <laughs> Scientists are that even if look your hand right is bigger than your face, mustache. you have cancer. Ha-ha! <laughs> Got you! Oh, ah, oh, that's not even really news. <laughs> Point of mustache. The chair recognizes uh, your mustache. We... That brings back memories, man. I've had that done to me so many times in my childhood. I've done that to plenty of people in my childhood. It don't feel good, but it does when you're not on the receiving end of a hand to the face. Discussed what to send Wilford Brimley next month as it is the 70th birthday of his mustache. Oh, I think we just send a nice card. Just make sure it has a mustache on it. Point of mustache. The chair recognizes your mustache. What can we as citizens do about mustache awareness? Good mustache question. We have a new product in our mustache catalog that makes a great stocking stuffer. We call it the mustache. The slogan is, you mustache <laughs> your mustache must in a mustache. Stash. That'll be all for today. Good mustache. Good, Good mustache. mustache. Good evening, everyone. Our top story, marijuana is now legal. 
le le is now legal. Legal. Here they go, legal. making it look stupid and it's again. Made everything. It does not make Just people so think and act like that. Unless they don't need to be smoking in the first place. Is your king to be <laughs> yeah. king to be be playing the role of Anna in the Quahog Players production of The King and I. Tom? Thanks, Diane. In other news, I won't Diane. be going to the play because I'm sure it will be lousy. Tom, I'm getting late word that you're a petty, jealous closet case. Bit of breaking news. We now go live to Diane being a bitch, Diane. From <laughs> at Jenny 94. Water seriously cold, yo. Here's at the Ted 69. I'm gonna survive this. LOL JK. JK. <laughs> Greg the weather mind. Okay, it's how could cold. you have a sense of humor cold. knowing you're gonna and, die? And there's gonna be wind, especially as a kid. Will throw fecal matter down on them from the rooftop. <laughs> oh, awful! Oh no, I'm, I'm sorry. That's that's rain. It, yes, it'll rain. Dad, there's an evil monkey in my closet. I don't care, son. I just do not care. Coming up, important what? traffic news that can't help you because you're someplace where a TV is. Since the laws of death no longer apply, I can do this. That's <laughs> right, Tom. <laughs> and now it's time for sports. <laughs> we interrupt this program because I have had kind of a crap day and I know all the station passwords. I don't care if you doing. can't so die, smell it's that still finger, fucking hard. Rain continues to pound Rhode Island. Let's go to Asian reporter Trisha Takanawa, who's gonna tell us all about the rain. Our top story, a local Yankee fan's dream comes true when he's diagnosed with Lou Gehrig's disease. Well, there you have it. Back to you, Tom. Thanks, Tom. Some damn fine reporting. And that is why chest hair is on its way back. And both sides appear to be at an impasse. Man, so ground control is blood. telling Major Tom this could be a long one. My, I get a lazy eye. <laughs> Does anyone else like David Bowie? Better hurry up, Mr. Tucker. I'm coming. <laughs> I'm coming. Our next spelling bee contestant is Omar <coughs> Mahajarif. Uh, something September 11th. Wish it, want it, do it. Am I pronouncing Just that correctly? Just racist as hell, uh, ain't he? Yeah. And it's non-fiction, right? Uh, uh, yes, it is. No, no, which one is that? I, I always forget. Is that the one that really happened or not? Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, so th so now so uh, this is this is a true yeah. story. Well, it's not really a narrative. Doesn't matter. I'm hooked. Peter Griffin and Omar North Tower. Omar, you'll be going first. Your word is coagulate. C O A. G. A. Oh, I'm sorry, Omar. Bet you could spell box cutter. I'm nine years old and I'm Indian. A police spokesperson was quoted <laughs> as saying, Duh, I'm a dumb cop. I like to give Tom Tucker a ticket. I was going like 41. It appears a new challenger has entered the field. The crowd has fallen deathly ill. Silent. Sorry. It's a tough world here. You hear about it every night on the dog news. Coming up, that bush in the park is my bush. It's my bush. Your word is... Lesbians. Can you use it in a sentence? The two lesbians are going shopping. Can you use what? it in a dirty sentence? The two lesbians are going shopping for double-headed marital aids. To him. Wait! Can you use it in a libelous sentence? Gillian Anderson and Helen Hunt are lesbians. L-E-S-B-I-A-N-S. -E Correct! Today we bring you a disturbing <laughs> case of child Wait. pornography. Local teenage scumbag well... Chris Griffin, whose name will be omitted here, was caught sending quote-unquote graphic selfies of his All dog, right, sure. not sure where that quote is from, to another underage student. Coming up next, teleprompter guy puts the period in a weird place. Would you consider growing a mustache? Weird place, is, and that's where I'm going to end it. Puts period in a weird place. But anyways, Tom Tucker, Tom, I said Tom Tucker, wow, Tom Tucker is a fucking weirdo. I don't know, he, I don't know, it's like he hates every damn body though. But anyway, subscribe to the channel, like this video as you already should have.
and comment on this video. Like, what was your best? Mo what was your favorite Tom Tucker moment that we just looked at? Or if it's not in this video, what's your favorite Tom Tucker moment? I know he says some racist shit. Uh, and all kinds of other prejudice type stuff, but they turn it into a funny most of the time. But anyways, I'll stop rambling. Till next time, y'all. Take it easy.